Outfitters and oh my god it's so freaking cute but this is what it looks like these are the stains that I got on the back of it morning well it's not even morning anymore. um so good afternoon happy vlogtober it is day three i am loving doing these um like you know pre-record because if i wait until literally every single day of october and try to do these vlogs it's just not gonna happen like this morning i started the vlog it was so chaotic because i was supposed to tell my housekeepers they didn't have to come anymore um and i was gonna reschedule to tomorrow because it, the weather here has been bad just because of the hurricane so i was it, like i was expecting them to not come and then come tomorrow but i forgot to call them because my morning was just so crazy um i had to jump up and you know get my son together because he was getting fussy because he loves breakfast and it was just a lot going on and then i tried to go ahead and get a head start the cleaners couldn't get in the building the concierge wasn't at the desk then um i can open it for my phone but then after that my son started to get fussy because he was supposed to go down 12 they got here right at 11 50 when he was getting ready to go down for his nap but i wanted them to clean his room dust his room um and you know obviously it didn't need like a deep cleaning because i get those once a month but um, it just needed like a reset so I didn't want him to be sleeping there and then they couldn't get his room together so I made him stay up um, until just now which is 124 he went down maybe like a 110 about 14 minutes ago um, so yeah he's like really really super tired and he was fussy and he loves being on his schedule so I was just like oh y'all and by the way I love these glasses these are like an everyday type of frames um, I got these from TikTok shop I don't even be like on TikTok shop, but they convinced me with these, okay? Like I needed some frames so bad because the other ones I had, they were like too thin and it was giving Steve Urkel, okay? Like I don't know, it was just, it wasn't my vibe. But yeah, so um, I say I that to say like, yeah, it, it was just like running behind. So I was like, yeah, I am going to pre-record these vlogs in October. So like for instance, I already have day one, day two, and then I'm about to have day three. I'm dropping day one tomorrow because um, it's October 1st tomorrow and I already have that plan and then Wednesday I will already have one but basically like tomorrow I'm gonna probably record uh, well no because I'm recording today so yeah so Wednesday his dad is actually off this week on Wednesday so I'm gonna go and try like a fall drink and probably do like a peer bar or Pilates class so that could be like a day I could do for you guys by myself um, and that could be for day four. So I don't know if you guys understand or not, but that's kind of like what we're doing this month um, for October because recording every day, it's just, it doesn't make sense when I can already like, you know, or I don't want to wait until like, oh, I can't go to take him to this fall festival or to the zoo until October 6th because I already did the other days. It's like, no, that don't make sense. I might as well, since I'm already ahead, I might as well do these days and then just save them for whatever day I want. So yeah, so today I am, right now I'm about to get ready. I already did my skincare, brushed my teeth, did all that good stuff. We ate breakfast and stuff. Um, but today is going to be basically get ready with me and like fall fit. Um, but it's not going to be like that fall fit that you guys are expecting. Just because, and I'm going to look here for my um, eyebrows. But just because this is have like basically this is going to have something to do with my business. Um, if you guys don't know, I have a clothing line called Attire Alert Clothing um, on Instagram, and it's just Attire Alert. Um, and I had dropped these sweatsuits and hoodies when I was nine months pregnant, and I only left it open for about a month um, just because it was a lot trying to do orders with a newborn. And obviously, you know, I was taking my time with, you know, just postpartum and everything. So I took the first year off. But now he's about to be two. I did drop something in the summertime, which something small just to get back in groove with things. And that was like a jumpsuit with. And then I also want to just reopen the sweatsuits and hoodies because you guys have really loved it out of all the things that I've ever dropped. 
So I was like, before I even add something new, because I am working on a new collection, which is going to be so different, something I've never did before. Um, well, it's obviously clothes, but like just something completely different. But I kind of like already said it on TikTok um, in the comments one time. Someone was like, oh my God, you should drop this. And I was like, yeah, I'm working on it. <laughs> so I'm trying to do that too for the winter time. But before I drop anything new, I want to focus on my um my drop that i haven't like completely sold out of first and then move on to the next day you know because it's like a waste like why not why i won't redrop that when i wasn't able to like you know get the experience that i wanted because it was it wasn't even open that long the collection um so yeah that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna um basically go based off of like my mood board i put like some images together last week and over the weekend on a mood board of what I want to do and you know how I want to drop all the content and things like that on my business page because I don't know if you guys know or <laughs> if you guys remember I had dropped the uh, before I was pregnant before I even became a mom or pregnant I had dropped like another collection in the fall and it was just like something it was like sweatsuits and crop tops and stuff but it was more so like for fall and like real thin material um so this one is more so like thick for winter but i had dropped that and i did a whole like campaign like i had models <clears throat> i had models i um did it in a different location like it was literally like legit i had my assistant which is my uncle we are the same age but i was paying him like he was helping me and my business was really like booming um so i was really like doing the thing this is like probably 2021 i want to say maybe or 2020 yeah 2021 um and yeah like i was really like pouring into my business and basically i say all that to say like that's what i'm trying to get back to I'm trying to do that but obviously because I have a baby and it's a little different trying to do like a photo shoot that was so stressful like we got there early that morning and I didn't get home till late that night like it was a whole day ship uh, it was a whole day like shooting campaign like it was a lot so um it's, it's different now that I have a baby so I was like you know what I can be the moose I'll be the model and I know like the angles and the things I want. And my uncle, he still helps me um, bring my visions to life and give his input and kind of tell me if I need to change something and stuff like that. So he's still back in North Carolina where I'm from, but we still talk on the phone and he helps me and we kind of like pitch ideas together and stuff. So that still helps. So now I'm like, my dad actually is bringing, well not bringing, he's shipping my inventory here because my i have an inventory storage there so he's shipping all my things for that collection um i actually spoke with him yesterday and we got everything together in the boxes so he's going to ship it out this afternoon probably in a few hours uh, when he gets off work so i have that in the process and then i'm hoping for october 18th that's what i'm shooting for to drop these uh sweats and hoodies again because the fall you can still wear it in the fall the winter and i if you're like me i like to shop for things before it gets freezing cold looking for stuff i want to already have it because the weather is so unpredictable like you can think oh it's not gonna get cold till this month and then out of nowhere it's like freezing cold and that's how it's been here um because we're like up north so so yeah like i'm super excited so today i'm gonna be showing you guys behind the scenes of me shooting some content which i did this last not last year but the year before when i actually dropped it and i was pregnant so i couldn't really get any content like i wanted to and it was a lot i was just so freaking tired like that pregnancy at the very end of the trimester honey i was burnt out like i was just so freaking tired so we're gonna try to get some content in since nolan is sleeping and one thing about me, when I'm done with content, I be taking my makeup right off. Getting in the shower and taking my makeup right off. I really treat this like a job because it is, you know, it's, I'm getting paid for it. It's just I'm doing all the stuff on the back end, like being the model and stuff now because I am a mom and I'm on crunch time. So it's like I don't have time to kind of like look for models here. I don't know anybody here. And then I have to wait for everyone's schedule, like to see, you know, when it aligns and 
you know, I have Nolan with me, so it's like I got to go based off of his schedule and I don't want everybody around my baby. So it's just like a lot that I have have to consider. So I was like, you know what? I could just do it myself. So I'm about to show you guys like the inspo pictures that we're going for and then that way I can have this one color out of the way because I don't have the other two colors um, that's in my size. So I have to wait until my dad send that but at least I can go ahead and start posting like this color and then mix in the next color. You know I'll have content, a bunch of content that I can post literally every day up until leading to October 18th. So that's what we're shooting for. And is it just me or like when I rush to do my makeup or not even like rush but I feel like I'm rushing because I don't want Nolan to wake up and um I don't know he's off schedule today so I'm like I gotta get this done I gotta get this done and I also journal too in my free time so I'm like oh, I want to journal I want to eat my lunch I want to take a shower I want to freaking watch my show like all that while he's sleeping and he's off schedule so I have no idea when he's gonna wake up but did I oh no I didn't like that but yeah, I'm about to show you guys the inspo. And I think they're like really, really good. It's just like a little aesthetic type of vibes because that's how my page is. Well, that's how it was when I did do the thing. But even with that jumpsuit I had dropped in the summer, I really didn't have the content, you know? Because it was like, it's only one color. It's not too much I could do. I had already like tried it on, did a fit. I did it on TikTok, so... And I mean, it did pretty well. I still made money, like especially the first few weeks. I was like, oh shoot, like, you know, cause I haven't dropped in two years. But it was like, obviously, you know, once people already bought it, it's like, okay, now what's next? You know, so I was like, okay, I have to move on. Um, So I'm expecting and hoping for this next drop that I already dropped. Some people already seen it. Some people already bought some colors. Um, but the people that knew and don't know, I feel like it's going to just do so well because I have like different supporters now. Not different, but like more supporters and a different audience on TikTok. So, but, um, I'm not even doing nothing too crazy. I just want some type of beat, like a little cute beat and... It is a little dark in the house right now because of the weather so hopefully I can still get some good light but I also wanted like cozy vibes too so I don't want like a bright shining green light on me so we're gonna figure out the lighting and everything but this is the hold on so these are the inspo so I have these for like just the clothes i also just got me a like clothing rod i had the clothing rod like back in north carolina but i don't know where i put it at and i had that when i had did the other drop and i used to do like little things like that kind of like aesthetic vibes things like that um and i also have hangers that's coming so i don't want to do those yet because i have the clothing rod but i don't have the hangers you know so um and then i kind of like got this inspo because i kind of wanted it to be like that on my actual instagram all different types of pictures and then i got this for like different type of poses for i don't know if you guys can see really but just different type of vibes and then i think what i'm gonna do is do another like mood board with all the like cream color that i'm doing today and then i can put coming soon or i don't know how i'm gonna do that but we're gonna get some type of content in with that color and i'm gonna show you guys after i'm done with my makeup what the um the cream will look like i did kind of stain it because i had washed it with darker clothes so it's like stains i can't get out of it but i'm gonna see if i could kind of finesse it because it's a cream color so i don't know if you'll be able to see it like if i do certain angles but we're gonna try to make it work because that was like mine that i had i already wore that a bunch of times so it's not gonna be like brand new but these are the hoodie and um, sweatpants these are the hoodie this is in the color hold on. this is in the color cream it's on my instagram i don't know if you guys can really see it i'm gonna show you guys that one that's the one i'm doing and then this is in the color mixed berry kind of like a purple color i called it mixed berry because it looks like blueberries <laughs> um and then this is a dusty rose because it's like a rose color but it's giving like dusty it's hard to show you guys because uh, yeah there we go um 
let me go back since I kind of found the angle yeah so that's what it's looking like um these are the pants I love the pants because it gives like that scrunchy like elastic band like snatches the waist but also not uncomfortable where it's like spandex it's like more cotton but it still gives that little pinch in you know I love that and then the pockets are deep which I love because I don't like when I wear sweatpants and like stuff all in my pocket if I sit down so the pockets are deep um really soft you guys can even tell by this picture Oh, no, let me see if you guys can get the quality that I see but this picture it's just like so soft I'm gonna show you guys the one I'm gonna wear today this is basically the one I'm gonna do same as that one actually that I have on it's just this one was like brand new like straight out the inventory box um but I was pregnant so it was hard to get content like in it like my belly was out I literally was nine months pregnant it was a lot going on so we're gonna try to get some content in that um yeah i'm super excited like i feel like i just feel like i'm getting back in my era with my business and i'm trying to balance that out also too it's been like a long journey just being at home being a stay-at-home mom i love that and obviously i'm going to continue to stay at home um but i do want to like well, i mean i was doing my business even with nolan but i do want to like just make sure I pour into that this year and don't leave it behind like oh just because I did one drop I'm not gonna drop it it's like no I need to already have backup collections of what I want to do and then as far as um Nolan like he is so smart I do so much with him I'm like really a hands-on type of mom um so it's like we do a lot of stuff like whether it's activities or anything like obviously he plays stuff and I still let him be a kid but also too like he loves craft work and everything um and i think it's because i've always just been like hands-on doing stuff with him so because i've seen this mom like on tiktok and was saying like oh you guys don't need to be letting your kids do craft work and stuff um please go let those toddlers play da, da, da. and i'm just like oh my god like what a i don't know i don't even know how to describe her i even commented and was just like oh my baby love craft work like I don't know I feel like everybody is different have their own thing but I just feel like that was so weird because it's like you're upset because other people are actually taking the time out to do activities with their kids and their kids actually like to color and do stuff just because you just which is called lazy just sit there and let your kids play and don't have no type of engagement so I say all that to say like he loves like craft work and stuff and I feel like the only thing we're missing is the social development because when we get around people whether it's like strangers in public or like my parents or because he hasn't even he haven't really seen anybody from my family um both sides of the family like that so it's like he don't really know majority of the time they're on the phone but like he just don't it's I don't know it's just hard because he don't know how to like you know kind of be friendly and stuff it's like he don't like sharing like he's just he's the only child so he used to just having his way and like you know even when we did go to houston a couple months back this summer um not even a couple months back matter of fact it was august yeah so he uh end up like we seen my friend and her baby or whatever and her baby was just trying to share and i'm like no one kept running away from her and stuff so it's just I say all that to say like he is gonna start school soon hopefully i like the schools that i'm touring um and i don't like cancel them all out hopefully it's something that guys have in the works for us because i'm leaving it up to him and his his plan i'm not gonna stress too much about it if something don't work out then it's not meant to be but yeah like he i want him to start school at least one or two days out of the week i wanted to do one but we're gonna shoot for two no more than two his ass said three but i was like no um and I just want him to have that, like, those days where he's actually engaging with other kids, being that he don't be around no kids, he don't have any cousins here or anything. And I feel like that would help with him, um, his social skills and being around other kids that it helped him, like, engage and, and want to, like, do what they do and share and be nice and stuff because it's so hard to get him to do that. And I'd be so embarrassed a little bit um, because I'm like, oh, my God, he won't share or he don't play with their kids or you know he just to himself like if we go somewhere to the park or something he'd have his own toy he'd be doing his own thing if a kid tried to play with him he'd just like go the other way get his toys and get up 
um, but he's just so used to independent play so hopefully that helps him that's what we're praying for and hoping for um, but he won't stay the whole day um, I probably take him like after breakfast and then um, pick him up in the afternoon or so so he won't stay like you know how they be opening like really early seven o'clock in the morning now he'd probably go like literally like right before <laughs> afternoon time like right before his nap time so he can play a little bit and then take a nap get up play do whatever um and then i'll pick him up so that's what we're praying for and hoping for so i'm gonna come back once i done i'm almost done with my makeup anyway but once i got all this together and then i can show you guys the sweatsuit and then we're gonna go ahead and get straight into this okay so i do have my ring light hopefully it don't make my camera do that thing where it go, where it'd be like it's too hot and stuff but this is the thing the um hoodie and it's just like this cream color um it has my initials on my brand which is attire allure and it's aa because i didn't want something too long on it um i just wanted something like really simple and cozy and y'all just got this watch ring from urban outfitters and oh my god it's so freaking cute but this is what it looks like these are the stains that i got on the back of it so i mean it's on the back so you probably won't be able to see it with my hood down and then you can also see like it's still like little stuff it's like right here on the pocket too so it messed that up but i might can kind of get it out and it's on the back so do not wash these with um like dark clothes i didn't wash those my man actually had put everything together and i don't wash like my light clothes with my dark clothes and it messed it up but i think the pants are fine yeah the pants are fine i think it was just the hoodie that he had washed so yeah this is like the elastic band it also has it on this where is that this side too so i try to put it on the same side but it is so t so we're about to put this on and i also for the ones that i know may ask i got this cute little lingerie not lingerie but it's like a it looks lingerie but it's a pj set and it is from amazon it's so cozy i actually had it on earlier this morning i slept with it and it was just so cozy um but when my cleaners came i took it off and i put on some sweatpants and stuff but i just threw this back on so we're gonna get dressed um and then i'm gonna come back and show you guys and i think i'm gonna do these glasses i don't know like maybe i could do some without the glasses and we might do some with the glasses but maybe i shouldn't put them on first if i'm gonna do some all just so it won't be thin and i didn't even do anything on my edges i kind of like just brushed them out to give like that little kind of like effortless baby hair look because i didn't want to like actually gel them down um so we're gonna see how it looks on and then i may do something with the bag but i know i'm gonna do like some cozy socks i want to do like my white ones but the thick ones but they're not as white anymore so i'll probably just do like some thin ones just to make out a little cozy cozy type vibes and it's raining so it's actually perfect weather hey guys so my bun is kind of well my flyaway is kind of coming up because i had to put this on but i think i'm gonna do some with just the the sweatpants too because this is just a regular pink, plain white long sleeve but these are the pants which oh my god they look so good still um and i just put on these like kind of like a light sage type of color i don't know what you want to call this color abricot maybe but i put this with these because i don't want to do too much white and i feel like this is just so cozy and i could do like the little aesthetic oversized sleeves on my hands and i think i'm gonna leave it like this or i may tuck it in i don't know i kind of like that little tightness ruffle thing right here but i'm scared to put the hoodie on because i feel like once i put it on i'm not going to be able to take it off and do no other pictures because i don't want to get makeup on it so i'm probably about to go do this first and then we'll do some in this because i still like the hoodie with this but i also like the coziness so we may could do some in here since i already got the bed made um so 
so I feel like a little cozy vibe right here. Okay, guys. Oh, I'm still zoomed in. Okay, girl. So I did just get some, as you guys can see, on the bed. We're going to look back at the um, inspo, and I'm going to go to the living room now and maybe get some of me probably putting the hoodie down or something on the ground, trying to um, look at, like, get the logo in, and then I probably do... I gotta look back at the thing and see but i'm about to move to the living room and i'm gonna give you guys a little bit more behind the scenes and then after that you guys can get the gifs and i'm gonna show you guys some when i'm done and then um that will be it so hopefully i can get some good ones in and then we'll be done <laughs> Make sure you can't see the stains on it either. So we're gonna try to cover that up by like doing this. Oh, y'all just seen me get some clips of me on the couch. I don't even know how those look. Um, but I end up putting on the yeah, I kind of like one of them. That's it. But my battery is about to die. But I end up putting on the hoodie, as you can see. I still have it on the tank top, but I'm going to, like, make it a little crop fit. And then I'm about to get some clips of that. And then I'm going to come back because I need to change my battery. And we're going to go over the pictures and see if I execute it. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in a little bit. I am finished. Um, I'm about to just go over a little bit of the pictures, the photos with you guys. Um... It was, I feel like I did well. It was successful. Obviously, if I had more free time, I could get so much more done. But I was trying to like do a one shot and keep it moving because um, I knew my son was going to wake up soon. And he did just that. I added in um, a TikTok because I was like, okay, you know what? Because I do um, fit checks and stuff on TikTok, I can kind of like dress it up. And then because I had to dress it up anyway for the photos for Instagram. So I was like, you know what? I could just do uh fit but like it's so ugly outside right now that the natural light wasn't hitting and then it was too much green light so i had to keep adjusting i went over it maybe like four i did like four or five videos and by the time i got to the fourth one he ended up coming out of the room and i was like oh my god so i had to like stop because he was trying to hug me and then he was trying to get in the video and then i was like okay papa you gotta wait he was not listening and then he went to the couch and i needed to get a little bit more photos on the couch so it was a lot uh, with him being awake and did what I was supposed to do. So I did go by the inspo. I did kind of change him up because I didn't want to like go directly on him. But I did like get some cute aesthetic photos. Obviously, I'm going to be able to crop them to my liking. But I kind of like wanted to get a little bit of a yep, the logo. And then I got some on the couch, like aesthetic vibes. Um... I also got me like taking off the hoodie but I'm also gonna make it like an aesthetic type of you know um, vibe on my page and then I got some of me sitting down like you know with my rings and stuff like this literally looks like freaking um, Pinterest photos and I came up with these by myself like I like the ones that I had I like the ones that I have but I was just like okay I want to make it more me so I did that I got a bunch though I'm about to go and look at them about to make Nolan's lunch get me some lunch and go and look over them and then I probably post the outfit and just kind of like to give people a little bit of a um teaser and i could just be like from my collection coming up or i'm redropping these from my brand um you know just to kind of like get the girls um going to the instagram and stuff and then i'm gonna start slowly but surely posting like the small clips um photos on my instagram i kind of gonna have to see how i wanted to be laid out and stuff and then once the rest of the stuff come i can do that 
and then I can get more photos with those and yeah so I should have enough to cover until I get the other ones and then I'll ease those in there as the drop because this one is actually my favorite color the cream one but yeah I got majority of everything done um <laughs> it was a lot like I said with Nolan I did pair him with my Asics which it was a perfect match these were a perfect match I put them with um these and I got this little bag and I okay guys that is it for day three i hope you guys enjoy this and i will see you guys in day four hopefully i can keep these coming back to back i don't know i don't know if tomorrow i'm gonna um pre-record anything because we have to go towards some schools for nolan so i'm not really too sure about that um obviously i know i'm not gonna take my camera or anything with tiktok youtube or whatever it will be toward school so i'll probably just wait till wednesday when his dad has an off day and do day four for you guys then because i already have now i have three days <laughs> backed up for you guys and tomorrow's october 1st so i am doing good with like keeping up with it and just trying to make sure i have something to post every single day of october but that is it for day three and i will see you guys later